Well, hi there, folks. This is Randy. You're in the Tramps World again. And we're in Lake Havasu City at the Rockabilly Reunion. This is a big show. This is a three-day show. We're going to be looking at rat rods, seeing some Rockabilly stuff. We're in the car show out here in the parking lot before the big crowds start on Saturday. We're on a Friday. So I'm going to take you around. We're going to look at some old cars, rat rods, maybe some classic cars. So sit back, relax, we're gonna play a little music, enjoy the show, enjoy the video, and give me a comment. Tell me which one of these cars you really, really like. And it's a bit breezy today, so hopefully the microphone will pick up all of my comments and all the stuff I talk about. So here we go. You can have your choice of And you know, you never know what people come up with at these shows. We spend a lot of time on these rat rods. At least some of them do, I think. There you go, you got the garbage can lid. And so we'll walk around today, but we'll see some more cars tomorrow. They'll add to it. Don't you know you put your Jaguar in the show along with all of the rat rods? Makes sense. Oh, look at that Cadillac. That's way cool. So the last couple of weeks and the last month or whatever, we've been at a lot of car shows. It's actually the middle of February here in Lake Havasu, Western Arizona, in the south. Oh, now that's a little bit tricky there. What do they call that patina? I call it rust. I could be wrong. Oh, look at that view of Grand Sport. Right, somebody make a comment, tell me what year that Dodge is, what model it is, I don't know. That's a nice car, we're going to get a picture of that one later. That one's for my friend Andy Miller. There's a 51 mark, Andy. Get yours out of the garage. That's when you need your moonshine delivered in barrels. Oh, there's a lot of cool cars here. 
So every week in the Tramps world, you're going to see something about motorsports. This happens to be a whole lot of car season right now. So for the next four weeks, five weeks or so, we have a car show every single weekend. A lot of fun. Then we get into boats. That car was at a show last weekend. I guess it didn't sell. Yeah, they drive them around here. Let's chase this guy down and pull him all the way around. There you go. There you go. You know how it is. We hear noise, we hear a motor, we go. Back to this T-Bird. Oh my God. So cool. I love the back seats in these. Look at a, just a beautiful car. What do you think, 58? Ooh, that takes some shining. That's like shining a boat. Oh, there's a whole lot of surface there. You bet. Charge RT, I think that's what a 73? 74? Oh, they got them parked tight in here. We scoot around making sure we don't run into anything. I love when we get these cars that are from different eras and different styles and they have nothing in common with each other other than their hot rods. Hey, a couple of ghouls. You guys are like my favorites. Yeah, yeah. But we always watch for the ghouls. And that's an old Cullis, and it's a very popular car. It's attracting people. Oh, shoot the other side of it. There we go. I think these two guys missed the parking memo. <laughs> Thank you. 
So this truck is so cool. Look all the way around this truck. Velour interior. And across the back. Outrageous. Yes, sir. That little sticker says, driver carries no cash. I should put that on my car. Have this rat rod looking thing no paint and look at that motor look at this motor absolutely immaculate <laughs> makes perfect sense to me it's a gunslinger they open up the roof, you got to look down like that. <laughs> got to thank him for opening the hood or opening the roof. I was determined I was going to take a look at this Ford. I had to wait for the zone to clear. There we go. That reminds me of an old black and white movie I was watching. Where that was like a car that was running from the cops. And it had some of those hoodlum kids in it. I think the hoodlum kids are like 27 years old or something. Willie's is just amazing. <laughs> hey, so let's start another row of cars. Custom cab. A Ford. Pickup truck. Oh, look at this one. Oh, for you pickup truck people. That's like the holy grail. And you might want to go racing. Old school racing. All right, they, they just have cars and trucks just randomly parked all over the place for your viewing pleasure. Don't forget to subscribe to the Tramps World. Give me a comment. Tell me what you think of these cars and these trucks. Now I happen to think that that Apache truck is pretty cool.
think this car is chasing me down. Oh, it's the Shelby. Yes, it is. There we go. How about that, you Ford lovers, you Mustang lovers? He said, license plate says it's a rare 68. We don't want to scare these people by jumping up on them, right? That's a nice one. More cars. Well, I've seen this car a couple times this month. It is really a nice car. Check it out. And it's for sale by the owner. Not for sale by somebody else, but that one's for sale by the owner. It's the best way to sell it. Sell your own car. I think. Unless you're not a good salesperson. Then you might get help. That's a cool little Jeep there. Oh man, we got a station wagon. Love them wagons. There you go. We got dark tinted windows. We got a little house paint blue colored. Chrome reverse wheels with baby moon hubcaps. Perfect. I think this has got to be kind of easy to clean, I guess. You just wipe it down. Thank you. I like the floorboards. So we got 30 or 37 or 38 something on the right. We should have given you some shelter, man. <laughs> yeah, it's a little, little cool out here right now. We got this little breeze blowing. And you know, over here in southwestern Arizona, we like it warm. And I guess if you're watching this, you're in New York or Pennsylvania or Minnesota or Wisconsin, then you're wishing you were here. Well, that's a cool car. Motorcycle. I like them Harleys. I like them Road Kings. Got the ape hangers. Got the, got the spoke wheels. Got looks like a 21 inch in the front. Fishtails in the back. There you go. 
There's the crash customs truck. Last week's video. Said hello to Crash Customs. Hot Rod Shop, in Lake Havasu City. So you go down over here, you go to crashcustoms.com. There you go. Or the other crashcustoms.com. Either one, look them up on the web. That looks like a very fun car to drive, doesn't it? Check it out. Oh my gosh. Sometimes you don't really know what to say about them, other than it looks like fun. It's got four wheels and a motor, and it's got a flathead, and it's, uh, yeah, kind of reminds me of one of those bodies that people have sitting out in the middle of a field or something. It's all got like weeds growing up around it and stuff, and they dig it out and do something with it. I love it. It works. Fun stuff. <laughs> uh, Harold's Bike Shop is in Bullhead City, Arizona. And last year during the Bullhead River Run, we stopped in and saw a grand opening kind of thing over at their place. Shot a little video of that. Twenty-five k as is. Twenty-five thousand dollars. Come on down here. You drop 25 grand and you just drive away with it and you can go to the Rockabilly show look at like that there you go oh international scout boy that's kind of rare I don't see very many of those Very cool. Oh, we got another car here. What do you think of that one? Leave me a comment. Tell me what you think about this Impala. It says 472 on the on the valve cover. All right, folks, more cars. Wow, this one's like refined. I mean, like it's real, like really, like painted up real nice. Check them out. Wow, it's really nice. Beautiful shiny motor stuff. Shiny front end. It probably doesn't ride like that Cadillac does, so. though. Left side, I guess. Got the dice. That's a working truck. And that's a working truck. Right, there's your hidden treasure. A 
lot of pickup trucks out here today. Probably see some more tomorrow. Oh, look at this one, really nice. Oh, that's pretty. Look how clean he is. Yeah, I know the new trucks are nice and everything else, but, you know, we love our old pickup trucks. And I am way out here in a quiet zone, and I'm still looking at cars. You're still looking at cars. You get your 55 Chevy and you put a matching trailer on the back and you are ready for a road trip. All right, here's another. So jack up the big Jeep and go driving over cars and rocks and all kinds of stuff. Try not to run over this car right here though. Let's well, see, these guys just, you know, park however they want. Oh. Oh, that is sweet. Check that out. What do you think? Do you like Porsches? Well, how about this one? Yeah, just a Porsche. Kind of. All right, man, you can low ride anything. You gotta look at this roof a little closer. Here on. These all metal flake these, yeah? See, we're way out in the parking lot. You're still looking at cars with me. This is Randy. You're in the Tramps world. And don't forget to like the video. <laughs> Comment on this video. Definitely share it. And definitely subscribe. And you can see more. The Tramps world. Motorsports videos. Because you're a gearhead. Oh, here's another couple cars you've seen. What's up? Oh, you guys look nice and warm out here. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah, that was a little detour because these guys low down chop shop and custom paint. And I have, I have a Lincoln Town car that's just dying to visit him. It's all white, I call it the fridge. Oh my God, look at this Cadillac. Oh, oh holy cow. I have to bleep that. Oh my God, look at this car. Well, what do you got to spend to get it there? How much work does that take? 
Look at that rear console, little drink holders. What do you think? Is that your Cadillac? Holy smokes. Yeah, so we're wandering around out here in the parking lot at Rockabilly Reunion. It's like year number 15, I think. Of course, we had like a COVID year thrown in there or two. I don't remember. Who remembers COVID year if we don't? Oh, look at this caddy. Oh, man, I love it. I love it. That's a beautiful car. I drive it. So have you seen your favorite car yet? Make sure you leave me a comment down below. Maybe this beautiful El Camino. <laughs> what do you think? Can you drive it? You bet, in a heartbeat. You drive the Cobra, you do that. With a 427. Or go low and slow. Got to go low and slow. Oh, look at this. Look at this. That's a super cool paint job. Did you put that video on YouTube? I mean, on uh, Facebook the other day? Down the uh, Oh, you bet. Yeah, yeah, that big old hour long bugger. That was, that was me. So yeah, so we're down here at Rockabilly Reunion. This is Randy and the Tramps World, of course. And every show is not complete unless the boat broker is there. Theboatbroker.com. And they sell everything from hot roddy looking, rat roddy looking, big giant trucks. To classic cars. Nice T-Bird, nice Corvette. Nice Pontiac Granville. Oh, and there would be my choice. Kind of. What do you think? So anyway, so this is the Bow Brokers. Financing available, classic car financing. And let's go look around. They also have boats, lots of boats. Little truck on the big truck. There we go. Offered for sale by the boat brokers. So let's go around here, go around the sign. We'll go around that beautiful pickup truck. Craigers. The right wheels have. Oh no, you missed this one. You see, this one got sold. It's sold, it's gone. It's gone. There's some more of those Pharaohs Car Club, they multiply. You can buy a 55 Chevy. Well, that's a nice convertible. Your Cadillac for your uh, Rockabilly Day. 
Oh, let's scamp around here. Duck and dodge, we got people with maybe a puppy dog or something. I don't want to get in their way. Oh, look at this, 67 Olds 442. Oh, that is a cool car. Boatbrokers.com, go buy it. Don't tell anybody I'm literally running away from these people. Okay, I got them now. They just followed me for like two blocks. <laughs> so what do you think? Think we covered it all? Pretty much. We're gonna go and we're gonna check out some more stuff, get some pictures. And this is Randy here in the Tramps World. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And like the video, share the video, comment on the video, tell me what you like about these cars. Tell me what your favorite car is. And then we'll dive inside and we'll check out the rockabilly down in the side where everybody's making noise and where all the vendors are.